three shovels of dirt, the Tri-Border Community and the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers marked the end of the month of the military child with the beginning of construction on a combined child care and youth services center. Again, it's an honor and a pleasure for me to kick off this groundbreaking ceremony and make the construction of a significant facility that will truly make a difference for our personnel who faithfully support the NATO Alliance every day. On behalf of the Corps, we pledge to you, we will work diligently with our partners, the Director of Family, Morale, Welfare and Recreation, the contractor, Bill Finger Berger, the Shinning Garrison, to ensure a quality facility that fosters the best child care and learning environment possible. Um, uh, folks as well as the garrison and we have NATO uh, input so that we can uh, provide the facility that the meet the needs of the parents and the community. The 8 million euro Joint Child Development Center and Youth Services Center will accommodate roughly 266 children from infants to teenagers. It will be a unique one-stop shop that will provide a safe and healthy environment for tri-border families all under one roof. The building takes up about half of the green space between us, and then behind that is a series of playgrounds. On this side is a basketball court, and I think one more playground before we hit the, the parking areas. This is Jennifer Aldridge, U.S. Army Corps of Engineers, Europe District.